today I want to start you out with me not in the suit, just giving you a look of the suit here. I'm going to go ahead and jump in it. You can see now, this is the simple spring that I have. Very thin. Maybe if I can get the angle turned just right, you might be able to see it there. And there's a spring that opens all three of the fingers, and I have another one inside on this hand that opens the thumb. Over here we have a different series of springs, kind of more of a burly spring design. Uh, I wanted to see how much different it would be to have a more powerful opening hand. And once again, there's the hand gripping and lifting. So there's our exosuit with its full robotic hand system in action. You can see that hand opening up there. So today we're going to do some simple grabbing with this and releasing just to show that both arms do work of our exoskeleton suit. Let's go ahead real quickly and grab the uh, tin can again. So there we go, we have that tin can in our hand. We can hold it, move it all over the place, set it down anywhere we want by simply extending the hand. So let's go ahead now and grab it with the other hand. So there you go, you can grab it with either hand. And once again, as we get it out to the extension, the hand will open up. The spring returns are working properly. Once again, let's grab it with the other hand. And then we got the can in our hand here. Let's set it back down. And there we go. A very simple way to have humanoid style hands for grabbing objects. Once again, with our opposite hand. Now you can hold that anywhere you want. You can set it up on top of a shelf if you'd like. Or you can just set it right back down to where you got it. And the hand will release it. The last time I grabbed this coffee can from the top, I'd like to do that again. But first what I'd like to see if I can do is do a dual hand grab onto this coffee can. Alright, so I can do a dual hand grab on something about the size of a coffee can because you can see my hands inside of that are very close together. Let's go ahead and put that back down. And there we go. We can go ahead and try it with the left hand again. So there we go, we can pick something up, hold it there, and not let it go until we want to. Right at the end of the stroke, you release kind of your pressure on the handle and it's going to let it go. You notice the hand doesn't close if there's no weight in it. You can bring your arm up to any position, it's not closing that hand. I push down on the hand, it's going to close it. I let go of it, it's going to open it back up. Alright, so let's try that with the right hand now to grab the coffee can. Oh, i got to go the right way with it. You can pick up the coffee can, bring it over to the side, set it down on top of something if you wanted to. You can hold it, walk around with it. And once again, at the end of the stroke, the springs on the hand are going to open up and release it nicely. Until next time, I hope you enjoyed. This is Mr. Teslonian as we get closer and closer to finishing our exoskeleton suit.